Very bold with her second serve. She keeps going for them until she finds her rhythm. that work incredibly well tonight. She seems to not mind the forehand. Wow. A little bit. Still has to have the right distance between her and the ball. Wait for the right opportunity. Oh. Probably could only go that way since uh, she had to go with a one-hander. It was a bit behind her. Capriotti not getting right behind them. Karen Burnett, Jennifer's trainer. <laughs> Jennifer's worked so much on her off-court fitness. Be Monica Sells rip a winner cross court. She says Karen has made such a difference in her tennis. She's made it fun for her to work out. Looks forward to doing it. Wow, those last three points just give me a flashback to the early 90s when these two had some extraordinary slugfests. I was just thinking the same thing. What memories? You wonder just how many more she would have won. Lou came very close to hitting that one wide, but it just clips the line and we're all tied up. Okay, that's about the, maybe the second worst call of the week. by Monica Sellis just keeps going for it, keeps getting closer to that line. Keep giving you Ferraris for crying out loud. great shots to win a point against Capriotti who just runs everything down. This lob not high enough. Two matches in the summer of 91 on hard courts that both went to 7-6 in the third. Look how far inside the baseline sells us to attack the second serve. Sells takes that first forehand and then sneaks in to take that swing volley out of the air. You mentioned it's so muggy and humid out there. Yeah, and at nighttime, it's actually worse. The sun not out to evaporate things, although it is a full moon, but it doesn't do much. either cross court or up the line. That was the shot that won her the Australian Open a year ago.
<laughs> That's one of those rallies you just shake your head. I mean, how do they do it for that long? You just have to think that it's taking a toll on Monica Sellis. I mean, she's having to hit so many great shots in one rally to win the point. But it's Saturday on ABC Sports. We're seeing a dazzling exhibition of power tennis here. There's not too many quadruple jumps or anything yet. We already up 2-1, second set. Pam Shriver, Mary Jo Fernandez. We're curious, who is going to play Serena Williams in the finals here? And shots like that, I think we could probably say Monica Sellis. Well, she can keep executing the way she has been. That's just too good. can still hit them even though she's missed a few from the back of the court and Capriotti having to run so much more at last she levels it up and what a final set in store. Let's hope so. If they carry on like this, it should be some encounter. Stay with us. Players having an easier time in this third set, holding on to their serve. Ready for play. Now, though, at four all, things could get a little tighter. Taking a lot of little steps, could have taken this one out of the air, decided not to. Unbelievable backhand cross court, just hit with so lead. points away from another. <laughs> Their 
are saving their best.